there's opportunities inside the classroom. There's always projects that teachers are working on that require your assistance. The opportunities go outside of the classroom. Every school or most schools have some sort of PTO or PTA and there's always activities whether it's selling food at events or just preparing for our different events that we have. At the district level, parents have multiple ways to influence not only the direction, but the decisions that are happening in our district. One way is to participate in our annual survey. By listening to the voice of our community and our parents, we are better equipped to make decisions that align with what the community expects of the district. Another level of opportunity and involvement is to get involved with one of our district-wide committees. Those include the Parent Advisory Council, that includes our DLAC, and that includes our Superintendent and Parent Roundtable. It is an opportunity for parents across the district to come in and meet virtually and participate in a meeting uh, where they get to hear from Cabinet the updates that are happening in our school district. ELAC stands for the English Language Advisory Council. ELAC is comprised of parents that have students who are English language learners. Parents can have an influence in curriculum and spending by getting involved in committees like School Site Council and ELAC. Together, it takes a village to raise a child, and so for us, it really makes a huge impact when we hear your voice because we know that you guys are the best advocate for your children and when we have your voice along with us, our knowledge, we can make some magic happen. So we do have a parent volunteer program where parents can call and set an appointment with our community liaison so that they can volunteer in the classroom. Una de las partes que pueden participar es asistiendo a las clases de padre que nos otorgan las escuelas en el centro de padre. E incluso hay talleres también donde nos explican y para cómo ayudar a nuestros hijos. A good starting point if you want to be more involved would be call the school, you know, ask when their next coffee with the principal is. Uh, call the community liaison, just ask about meetings that are going on. Go on their Facebook page, on their Instagram page, go on the school district page. There's always a lot of information about things going on. It's very important to the Azusa Unified School District to hear the voice of our parents and our community. And this is just one opportunity to listen to what parents are thinking and what they are dreaming uh, for their students.